friends in this lecture we are going to understand and cover the topic that is how to manage a linux password expiration and aging using the chase command this is a very important and easy topic to understand in any organization or data centers where we have number of servers to manage it could be a linux servers solaris hp unix aix as a security concern the users need to change their password at a regular interval the best practice recommends that users keep changing their password at a regular interval but typically what happen the developers the dba the application users they won't change their password unless they are forced to change their password so it's the system administrator's responsibility to find a way to force them to change their password so that they have to you know change their password at a regular interval of time so in this lecture we are going to understand what are the different you know commands which can be used to you know set the password aging or expiration information of a user so friends the command which we are going to understand is the chase which is an acronym for change is this command is basically used to change the user's password expiry or aging information any user can execute this command with the i hyphen l option to view their passwords and aging information no other unauthorized users can view the password aging expiry information only root user can execute this command to modify the information or a normal user only view their own password expiration information with this command so this is the syntax you can see we'll understand this syntax while doing the lab session so first of all we need to understand what all the things we can do with the chase command so friends this is a very simple command chase hyphen hyphen list and the username what will happen it will give you the detail about the users here in the ppt we can see the user dinesh has last changed his password on august 1st 2017 and when his password is going to expire inactive account expires the minimum number of days between the password change maximum number of days between the password change and number of days the warning before the password expires so all the information about that particular user you can see with this command so we will be learning how we can you know modify these settings so that a users needs to change their password forcefully we would be understanding each parameters like what is password expiration what is password inactive account expiration and what are these minimum and maximum number of days warnings so let me first you know move to this ppt okay now this is a good example you can see here you can see the last password change we have just fired the command chase hyphen l and the username after that you can see the in detailed information related to the password expiration and aging is showing for that particular user last password change that is on 1st of august and then password expire this is just an example the password expire will be on august 10 it means after 10 days the user's password is going to expire then what is password inactive that is of august 20th and what is account expiration first we will under understand what is password expiration password expiration means on 10th of august the user's password is going to expire and what is password inactive when user will try to log in suppose user has not changed his password till 10th of august and what will happen when user will try to log in to the server on 11th of august when the user will try to log in on 11th of august what will happen the system will forcefully ask to change the user's password whenever you will try to log in with your password with user credential it will ask forcefully ask you to change your password then only you would able to log in to the server till 
suppose users has not changed his password till 20th of august 11th august 12th august 13th august the user was not you know available or he or she just neglected it and has not changed his password what will happen the day reached to august 20th user has not changed his password till august 20th till 20th what will happen at least user has an option to go inside the server after changing the password the system is giving you an option like you can just change your password and after that you can log into the system now the user has not changed his password till 20th of august now 21st august has come and user has not changed his password now what will happen his password is inactive user won't able to access to the server he or she needs to talk to the system administrator to reset his password till 20th of august user has an option to log into the server he has he or she has just needs to change his password the system is asking forcefully to change his password now suppose user user was on long vacation and uh, he or she was not able to you know change his password till 15th of september what will happen users account will expire and once the account will expire what will happen users needs to provide the proper justification why you are not able to change your password till 15th of september or whatever this is just an example so friend this is you know basic idea about this then what is minimum number of days between the password change suppose you know uh, i have set it for 2 days minimum number of days what will happen the user has changed his password on 1st of august so after till 2 days next 2 days user won't able to change his password he or she needs to retain that password at, at least for 3 day 2 days so this is called the minimum number of the days between the password change okay maximum number of days between the password change this is the same as password expiration as soon as you will put 10 days your maximum number of days between the password change will be showing 10 days here and number of warnings number of days the warning before the password expiration it means suppose it is set as 7 so suppose a uh, user has changed his password on 1st august so after 7th of august what will happen whenever user will try to log into the server he or she will start getting a warning message like your password is going to expire in next 3 days so please change your password so this is the warning message a user will start getting once he or she will try to access the linux server so this is the all about uh, Uh, the password expiration and easing using the chase command so friend that's all for this lecture in the next lecture we would be doing a lab session to understand more about this thanks for watching and if you have time please join with me in the next lecture